if you're doing this just as a hobby because you want to start making money in this industry, you can. First of all, you can have something beautiful to look at on your wall versus having to get this investment report every month that's depressing. <laughs> and you just want to rip it to shreds when you get it in the mail. And you know what? It's a safe bet to hedge against inflation and market volatility. So if you compare art to the stock market over five to 10 years, it outperforms the stock market. In the long run, art is a very good investment. There are a lot of things that you need to know about because chandelier bidding, it can exist. And there can be third party guarantees and you don't even know when you're bidding, who's bidding against you. It's important to keep on top of the art fair just to train your eye. To go to fairs like this and to be able to distinguish good, better, best. It's always important to have your appraisals updated. We recommend and tell our clients every three to five years. There's some clients that have works, we update their appraisals every year. The star power is unbelievable. Then they would never get this price tag of $28 million. Because you can find these treasures. Um, and we people will come in and then they we tell them this is worth thousands of dollars and then they start crying You know this is worth more than my house The treasures are out there